uh, once again, good morning. So it's around 11 o'clock now in the morning. So this is like one of the perfect time na mag spray ka. Bakit? So during that time na apply ka ng fertilization or insecticide. So siguraduhin po natin na wala na ang mga pollinators. Ano ba yung mga pollinators natin? There are insects. They are the one who could help us to do a natural pollination para magkakaroon ng a successful production ng ating cacao. So, ang i-apply ko ngayon is insecticide. This is a combination of insecticide then the fertilizer. Since it's a newly prone cacao trees, so, as what I have mentioned, para mag out natin yung mga naputulan na area para hindi siya maataki ng mga fungus and other uh, pests we have to seal out with with the, with the insecticide uh, for insecticide you can refer to your technician or to store what are the most uh, recommended or prescription for your plant also for fertilization it depends it, it depends on the needs of your cacao kung uh, what type of uh, fertilizers or nutrients na kailangan nila okay so but before you will proceed with your fertilization and application of insecticide siguro dahil natin that you have to wear the mask and of course you have the sprayer so for recommendations on the composition of the insecticide in fertilizer you have to refer to the guidelines okay and of course we don't have to forget our personal protective measures face mask i suppose to have gloves and then boots but in this manner for the sake of art no joke like this is we're going to proceed now okay so for cacao na merong uh, maraming flowers uh, zoom in so I uh, will make it sure that during the application of um, the fertilizer and second side it should be like 24 centimeters away like moist lang ang gagawin natin to make it sure na hindi matatanggal yung mga flowers but for the non-flowering uh, area so we can spray like as closer as, it, as possible okay so I am now starting to pump in so I will get a oxygen sa loob then, of course, I have to wear my mask in a bit. Thank you. So, I will apply like uh, from higher, from the higher part to the lower part para pag, pag uh, during pag target, um, pag project mo ng nozzle, diretso pa from top to bottom. And also, you have to focus also for insecticides, you have to focus here at the bottom part kasi dito nakalagay yung, or situated ang stomata ng plants. Like basic biology, stomata is not located here, but here in the upper portion. So we have to make it sure that when we uh, target the nozzle, it should be directed to the stomata so that it will be absorbed directly. Okay? So hold on. Alright guys, so if you have like an experience in applying fertilizer and, fert and insecticide, so uh, in one kill of the cow, it will take like uh, less than 3 minutes, okay? So uh, if you notice a while ago when I 
focus when you apply the fertilizer like it is like uh, para moist lang kapag flowering na yung ating uh, cacao to make it sure na hindi mo hurt or maapektuhan yung kanyang flowers okay so in the next session for our cacao talk we will be introducing some other tips on the maintenance how we're going to take good care of our cacao as we go along because we are now on the stage of fertilization so we're going to making sure that we can we assess the development of the uh, pods so next lesson we're going to uh, do the proper maintenance what is the proper timing then what are other activities okay so thank you for watching don't forget to like share this video and of course comment thank you so much bye bye